Hey guys, this is Ace Paper here, and today we are going to be doing another uh, e-juice review, and it's from an old friend of ours that we just got reloaded with a few juices, and that is Euphoria Vapor out of Ohio. Um, I love the Midwest com uh, companies. Uh, they're for whatever reason, their their flavors usually hit the spot really well with me. Uh, this is from their EV drip line, uh, which means uh, it's a it's for uh, dripping and for bigger clouds, higher VG content, and uh, really really nice glass bottles too. By the way, which is really cool. I like the glass bottles. Last time I got a uh, got some from them, I got them in plastic bottles, and oftentimes that's what they'll send their uh, their reviewers is in plastic bottles just because it saves, you know, probably saves a little money for them. Uh, this is a zero nick, so um, let's give it a vape. And this is called, I forgot to mention that, it's called Die Hard Fans. Die Hard Fan. And they, uh, they didn't tell me exactly what was the flavor of it. They just, you know, assured me that I would recognize it. And so I've dripped it all of one time. And within the first drip, I was able to tell what it is and tell that I liked it a lot. So um, let's give it a vape and we'll talk about it. And this here is Fruit Loops. As soon as I vaped it, I was like, that tastes like Fruit Loops, and I've never done, believe it or not, and you can look at the reviews. I've never done cereal. It's possibly a new category for me, and uh, so I've never done a cereal review. And actually, until uh, this one, I had never vaped cereal. I just something I just never have done. I take that back. I've done Fruity Pebbles once. Um, I did do a Fruity Pebbles. So, um, but other than that, this. Uh, this one here I was excited about. And so I sent a little tweet over to uh, Euphoria Vapor saying, Is that Fruity Pebbles? And sure enough, it was. And it is spot on. I mean, it is dead on for Fruity Pebbles. And it's it's just amazing how, um, how much it tastes like Fruity Pebbles. I mean, it's got the flavor down. And it even has, which I've... I've uh, I'm a big fan of is it even has a little bit of that um, milky flavor to it too. And I just dropped my sorry, dropped my jerk tip. Um, I wanted to show with a real hit um, what the uh, vapor production is because this is supposed to be a um, a cloud making uh, vape. So we're gonna give her one more vape so that way we can talk about that as well. And for me, that is what I want from a um, from a drip line, a sub ohm line, a a higher VG content line. I don't need, and I don't do competitions. I don't need <clears throat> a cloud that goes all the way across the room. I like to be able to get a nice full cloud that is dense that you can't see through I've seen some you know I've done a few um, high VG drip lines that yeah they'll they'll make a nice cloud as far out as you want to go but it's not that dense this is a really really nice dense and it's actually funny because it, it comes out and it's nice and dense and when it comes down you know it'll 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 fall because of the density and it'll mix in you know I can feel the vape and it's a nice cool interesting flavored vape it's a really really I do like the um, that a lot and the flavor is there um, and there's very very few higher max VG vapes that you can actually get the flavor in um, I actually wanted to do a uh, award uh, for the max VG flavor of the year um, 
in my ACE awards this year, but I didn't do it because I couldn't find enough companies to to be in it. Um, that's how rare it is to find a juice that makes a a big dense cloud, b flavors that you can taste, and then c flavors that you can taste that are good. And this one does that. Um, this is I'm gonna say I'm gonna and and I'm trying to be a lot tougher on reviews this year, um, but it's been hard because I've done Suicide Bunny so far this year, and now I'm moving on to uh, this one. I really wanted to crack down on my reviews, and I am because you know we got to raise the bar. The company's raising the bar, so I got to raise the bar with the reviews. Um, but this here is a solid eight out of ten. It gives me everything that I want, and it is. It's a wonderful all-day vape. Um, it's probably, it is the best flavor that I've had from Euphoria Vapors yet. Um, and they make some really nice ones. Their Ohio City is really nice. I like that a lot. Um, they make a nice Beach Bomb, uh, Love Potion. Uh, there's some really nice flavors that they make. But this one here, really, really good. Um, I'm still not a big fan of... Um, not telling me what's in it. Die Hard fan. It, it doesn't scream Fruity Pebbles to me. Um, or not Fruity Pebbles, excuse me. Uh, Fruit Loops. But, you know, that's the only complaint I have. So I'll, I'll, I'll be good at that. I'm, I'm a simple person. I like the, you know, like their next one that I'm going to be reviewing. Crunch Berries. That's a lot easier for, uh, for a unsmart guy like myself to figure out. Um, Captain Crunch berries. So, um, I'll be doing that one next. But it, this is a really, really nice 8 out of 10. If you haven't tried Euphoria Vapor yet, you know, definitely try them. They're a really, really nice company. Made in Ohio. And, uh, you know, they're, they're doing some really good stuff over there. So, so give them a try. And, uh, until next time, this is Ace Vapor saying, love what you vape.